Hey guys, this is JJ with Express Workshops. This week I draw and paint a caricature inside of Photoshop. Okay, this is a screen capture of a caricature that I did of the actor Don Cheadle. Now, actually, and this is important when it comes to caricatures, I'm actually drawing or caricaturing the character that he plays on House of Lies. So even though it's Don Cheadle, it's actually Marty Kahn. That's the character that he plays on House of Lies. So um, I have to kind of look at that character to get the caricature that I'm looking for. Because, uh, you know, Don Cheadle also, you know, he's been in lots of movies and he's um, also uh, done lots of roles where, you know, they're more serious or um, they're, you know, he was uh, in Iron Man. So um, if I was doing a caricature of him in that context, then I would have to really uh, check out what actor is actually portraying. So that's one of the things you have to look for whenever you're doing a caricature. You're not just doing a portrait or a caricature of the actor, though you might want to do that too, but in this case I'm doing a caricature of his character. So, um, so anyway, what I'm doing here is you can just see that I am just drawing um, as if I was drawing on a piece of paper. I'm just sketching things out and in this stage, I'm not really worried about all the details. I'm just going in and making sure that I have everything placed where I want. And at this stage, it kind of does look, you know, kind of like a, a child's drawing or, or something because I'm just um, keeping my, um, my, my pencil strokes really light and um, just kind of trying to capitalize on the actual framework of what I'm doing. And here I added another layer in Photoshop and I'm just going around and refining what I've done. And, and I'm not really tracing over the lines per se. I'm just going in and just refining the drawing that I have underneath. That's one of the advantages of using Photoshop is that I can just create another layer and go in and, and, and you know, make the opacity on the layer below it light and just draw right over it. So um, I, I I don't want to ramble on. <laughs> I tend to do that whenever I'm I'm uh, drawing, but um, with with a caricature, you really have to pay attention to getting a likeness, and and I think that that's pretty obvious. But um, that's you want to have the, the, the likeness, but you don't necessarily um, have to, um, you know, just draw a portrait of that person. That's not what a caricature is all about. A portrait will actually just um, copy what you see on the photograph or if you're doing a, a person live, where a caricature is really you're getting their likeness, but also you kind of want to get some of their character, what your feelings are when you actually see this person. So that's what I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to work out some of that stuff and I'm going to do um, a painting on this. So I'm not really going to be really crazy here about getting, you know, every little uh, value right with my sketch. I'm just going through and trying to make sure that I have um, a nice foundation for it. And one of the things that um, I thought about when when I did this um, caricature and thinking about doing it for um, you know a video is that uh, um, it's kind of hard to see where the artist is going with things. So at this stage, you know, it may not look so much like the uh, person um, and, and really that part of the process is, is really kind of hard because you, you think it just at any minute you're just going to have to stop and say this is just not working. But uh, my advice is and what I do is I just keep working through it. I just keep going and I keep adjusting and I erase lines and I make things darker and 
Um, the beauty of doing it in Photoshop is if I've got the nose right, but maybe the eyes are a little small, I can go in there and just shrink the eyes down. So um, definitely there is an advantage of using uh, Photoshop. So um, that's what I'm doing now. I'm just kind of going through and getting some of the values. Um, in a few minutes here, you'll see that I'm going to just make the background gray and uh, start painting on top of that. Um, and the reason that I'm doing that is because I want to be able to see my darks as well as my lights. And this is just a value painting, so there won't be any color in this. Um, and I want to be able to go right in and see where my lights are and where my darks are. Um, and I can't do that if I'm doing it on just a white background. So when I put the gray background on here in a few minutes, you'll kind of understand uh, where I'm going with that. Um, again, I don't want to ramble through this entire thing. I'd rather just uh, be quiet and kind of let you see what I'm doing. And um, uh, also, I, I do have this video um, sped up quite a bit here. It's it probably took me about uh, four hours to do this caricature and I really probably could have put in another hour at least of detail but I just kind of stopped for the sake of the video um, and uh, if this video is too long which it'll probably be about an hour um, you can look at the finished video and it's sped up quite a bit more um, I have a link to it here you can click on that and go to the that video so um, Again, I don't want to just ramble on and ramble on about it, but I do want to say some things about um, when I am doing the values here. I want to make sure that I just copy the values that I see in my reference to my actual caricature, and that's what's going to bring out the likeness. That's what's going to, to happen. Even though I'm, I'm, I'm doing a caricature of this person, um, I do have to make sure that the shapes that I see and that I draw are the same shapes that I um, see on the reference. If not, then my likeness is gone. So um, I might be exaggerating that shape. I might be making that shape a little bit taller or wider or darker or whatever. Um, but that shape has to be there and it has to be in proportion to the actual other uh, drawing. So um, that's really what a caricature is all about. And what I'm going to do um, over the next few weeks is I'll probably do a lot more of these caricatures. Um, I really like the way that um, uh, they turn out. I've done them for you know many years and I, I think there is an interest out there in people just watching um, uh, caricatures done. So um, again, here's where I'm going for the, the gray value for the background. I'm just making one uh, value and then I'm going in and I'm starting to put in some darks. And I still have my drawing there and I don't want to be able to, I don't want to lose my drawing that I had. So I'm just using um, a layer underneath my actual pencils to start blocking in everything. And here it's going to be very, very, very loose. Um, I'm just trying to get the values right. I'm looking at my, um, uh, my reference, kind of uh, squinting my eyes a little bit so I can see those shapes better. And I'm just going back and forth and making sure that I have the right value in the right place. And eventually, if I get all those values in the right place, even though, again, it is exaggerated, then I will get the, um, the likeness that I'm looking for. Okay, I think I'm just going to shut up. And I'm going to uh, let you just go ahead and look at the uh, rest of the video. I hope that you stick with it. There is um, a lot uh, more... Uh, things that I'm doing here with this and I, like I said it is sped up um, it's not actually four hours long it's probably closer to 50 minutes long so um, if you stick with it um, I'm sure you enjoy and uh, kind of learn more just by watching what I'm doing here um, 
again there's this other the other video is only about three minutes long if you want to see what it looks like when it's finished very quickly or you can just speed ahead on this video uh, whichever you want to do um, I am going to just maybe play a little music here um, if you don't like the music then you know I just turn it down uh, I just try to give you something so it's not just silence um, make sure that you subscribe to my videos um, I'm, I am going to do a lot more of these caricatures. I may even go in that direction of just doing screen captures of, of things that I draw because I really do enjoy that. But uh, make sure that you hit the like button down at the bottom. Uh, subscribe to my channel so that uh, you can see when I have a new video or caricature out. And I um, hope you enjoy the rest of the video and I'll see you next week with a brand new video. Thanks a lot.